I'm Susie with Splore. You've learned a lot about adaptive canoeing, seating, paddling, and the whole nine yards. Some other things I want to make a point of is safety. I always take safety first. One of the main key things with safety is having the appropriate PFD, or personal flotation device. What you want to do is have your participant uh, put it on. It buckles in various locations, and it'll also zip in the front. So Breland will put that on. And there's a variety of different uh, personal flotation device. This one right here is called a Type 3 PFD. Um, meaning that it's great for canoeing and more flat water surfaces. Um, if you're going river rafting, you want to choose a type 5 PFD. The differences between the type 3 and 5 is just how much flotation support it gives you. A type 3 gives you less flotation support than a type 5, but for canoeing, a type 3 works great, and it's what we're going to use today. Um, so now that Breedland has this on, if he lifts up his arms here, there's places here on the side that we can tie it and adjust it to him. And we'll adjust it to both sides so it's nice and snug. We want people to be snug in here but still able to breathe. And then I always do a safety check to make sure it's on tight enough. And the way I do that is I will grab the lapels and I'll pull up. And I'll give a nice snug pull on it. If the lapels go up past his ears, then the PFD is not on tight enough and you'll have to readjust it to make it tighter and snugger to the participant. So personal flotation devices are also a key safety concern that you want to work with when doing canoeing.